Welcome to Boat Show TV. Let's catch up with our host, Stu Jones, at the Daytona Boat Show, presented by Central Florida Chevy Dealers. Hey, gang, welcome to our first episode of Boat Show TV. We're here at Daytona Beach for the Daytona Boat Show. It's the middle of January. It's cold and freezing everywhere else in the country. It's a balmy 80 degrees Fahrenheit here in Daytona Beach. But we're inside right now, and we're at the Daytona Boat Show for the first time representing the Boat Show TV format. We're going to show you all kinds of mainstream boats today, from small to medium size to big size fishing boats, bay boats, center console boats, cruisers, pontoon boats. It's all here at the Daytona show. So we haven't got much time. We got a half hour Boat Show TV episode number one. It's showtime. Our first stop at the Daytona Boat Show is Atlantic Marine, a family run business with an extensive line of boats. Let's talk a little bit about everything you have here, starting with Edgewater. Yeah, we've got uh, the Edgewater center consoles here. Some of their uh, dual consoles are here. Uh, and they're just a real nice boat. The nice thing about them is they're right down the street from us, the factories in Edgewater. Uh, also, I'm looking over my shoulder, Pioneer, mm -hmm. beautiful boat. Yeah, they're a nice boat also. What do you do when a family walks in the front door, they give you a call and they, or they email you, and they don't know what they want to buy? How do, you, how do you handle that? You try to find out what their needs are. A lot of times it's creatures of comfort or it could be just fishing in general, and the seating is always important to most everybody, whether it be uh, you know, the, the driver of the boat, uh, the wife, the kids. Sure. So you want to make sure you try to meet as many uh, of their needs as possible. There's probably no absolutely perfect boat sure. out there, but the yeah. one that meets most of their needs is the one for them. What would you do on a perfect day, a beautiful Saturday, you're off for the weekend, what boat would you get in and where would you go? I'd probably get in the 318 Edgewater and go about 30 miles out to the Gulf Stream. 30 miles to the Gulf Stream here yeah. in Daytona. And you're gonna catch what, some dolphin, I suppose? Yeah, dolphin, wahoo, whatever we can get into. Our next visit was with Justin Miller from Dealer's Choice, representing the full line of Chaparral and Roballo boats. We've had a very successful show. Um, Chaparral and Roballos, primarily what we sell, and we also handle Berkshire pontoons. But uh, we have boats from 18 to 42 foot, a lot of uh, rebates and uh, extended engine warranties here at the show. I think that's important for you guys to know. The shows are where you're going to get your best deals. Let's talk about the product. They came out with uh, nationally advertised boats, you know, on the smaller chaparrales, the H2O lineup. Yep. And it's real deal, no haggle pricing. You know, the, the price is really low and we're very aggressive on them. They've actually um, done the opposite of what most manufacturers do and brought the price down for 2014. And uh, it's also worked well on the Roballas. And then the new Robala Cayman 22 Bay boat is here yep. on display, um, which is a brand new boat for them. They're just now getting into the bay boat market, okay. and uh, I think uh, they're going to take it by storm. And, and uh, we've already sold a few bay boats here at the show. Do you have many saltwater boaters? And if you do, uh, what, what kind of boats are they going to buy for the saltwater environment? Most of our customers are actually saltwater customers, even though we are in Orlando. They own yeah. second homes or, you know, just like to venture out to the beach. Sure. And since Chaparral is you know, parent company with Roballo, right. the boats are better in the salt water because they build true offshore boats sure. and they use the same materials on the chaparral. So, you know, our boats are better than anybody's in the salt water. Next stop, Aloha Marine, where owner Dave Rustler gave us a complete tour of their full line of boats at the show. Right, let's talk about this uh, multiple line dealership. You're mm -hmm. here in Holly Hills, which is Daytona Beach. Right. 40 years, congratulations, yep. 40 you. years yep. since 1973. Yep. Uh, but I wouldn't know where to start. I come here and I see everything from deck boats to pontoon boats, runabouts, fishing boats. You got it all. We've got it all. <laughs> Ab absolutely. We got the Avalon line, which is the pontoon line. They're made up of Michigan. Uh, really nice, yep. nicely built, yep. uh, well laid out. And then the ever popular hurricane deck boats, of course. which is one of the most popular boats uh, in the southeast right now. Yes. Also, Carolina Skiff, for those that like to fish, get into the skinny water. Key West is behind us here yes. for those that want to go offshore and do a little bit of that kind of fishing. More of an offshore boat, right? Absolutely. Mark? Yeah, yeah. Okay. very nicely appointed. Uh, mm -hmm. We have the Bayliners, and then we've got uh, Regal, which is made right here in Orlando or close by in Orlando, and That's they right. go from 19 to 52 feet. There is nothing else that a uh, you know, whole family can do and have fun. You can take and ride, you can fish, you can travel, you you can do and in Florida we've got so much water I mean why would you want to do anything else when we come back boat show TV returns with coverage of the Orlando boat show presented by the Marine Industries Association of Central Florida boat, boat. 
Looking for an amazing fish boat? It's time to experience Blackwater. They run 70 miles per hour, getting you to the fish faster. Check out our latest creation, the brand new 36 Sport model with full wraparound forward and rear seating. And live wells too. Brand new and in stock starting at just $229.9. Get pre-approved now at BoatsDirectUSA.com to schedule a sea trial. Call now, toll free, 866-377-5403. Mile marker 98, Key Largo. Nautical Ventures Marine Superstore wants you to get on the water. Check out our new 30,000 square foot waterfront showroom on over three acres, featuring power boats, fishing boats, pontoon boats, hovercrafts, tenders, kayaks, and SUPs. Get 20% off select items during our grand opening sale. Register to win a Hobie kayak, Riviera SUP, GoPro camera, and more. Nautical Ventures, the go to people for fun on the water. Take Sterling Road east of I 95, go left on South Bryan Road. Get, get on, on the water. water. Hey, wait a minute. I know that face. It's not your everyday face, but I know it. It's a face of joy, of calm, a face of exhilaration, even surprise. Oh, I know where I've seen that face. Welcome to the water. Step into boating with our free DVD at discoverboating.com. Welcome back to Boat Show TV with full coverage of all the leading Florida boat shows. So let's get with Stu Jones as we showcase all the highlights. Hey, gang, welcome back to another great episode of Boat Show TV. Stu Jones here at the Orlando Convention Center. It's late January, and we're getting ready for the Orlando Boat Show. Remember, Boat Show TV covers four big categories, cruising, fishing, water sports, and yachting. Well, we've got three of those categories covered here at this show. All kinds of boats inside, about 43 different manufacturers and about 10 big dealers here, part of the Central Florida Marine Industries Association. But there is one powerboat at the show and it's right outside here, this 28-foot Panther getting ready to race the Powerboat P1 series. You can go on our club website and check out the series plans at flpowerboat.com. Meanwhile, we got a lot of boats to check out here. Let's get inside. It's showtime, the Orlando Boat Show. Sunny's Marine Center is all about fishing, and we even had a chance to meet a professional fishing celebrity. Stop by Sunny's Marine Center here. Keith Easel on my left, who's the owner and operator and a little bit of everything, right? On my right, uh, celebrity fisherman here, Captain Blair Wiggins, star of Addictive Fishing. So we've got all the fishing brass here. Keith, you got a nice display. Tell us how the show's going for you. Show's been great. Um, we've got, of course, Skeeter boats in here. We've got G3 fishing boats, G3 pontoons. Try to have a selection for uh, you know all your fishing needs and all your boating needs. What are you going to be riding in this year? Well, actually, this is our first year with Skeeter. We've yep. been with a previous boat company for the past 13 years. I've been secretly riding in Skeeters out in Louisiana, you know, pre-fishing out there. And uh, the opportunity came up where we could come aboard with Skeeter, and I, I couldn't be happier. We know there's all sorts of wakeboard fans and water skiers out there. So the Boat Show TV crew stopped by Southeast Marine to check out the latest from Tiger Boats. We're here at Southeast Marine, and I stopped by, um, met Eric Ruck, who's actually a, a competition rider with Tiger Boats uh, from Texas. What's different about a Tiger? They're really cool boats, but they've got some unique styling to them. Uh, the difference is, is that Tigers are built and designed for wakeboarders and wake surfers and designed specifically for that reason. You've got a neat feature on this boat I saw. Tell us what this feature is, what do they call it, and what does it do? It's called the Convex VX, and it is designed to give you a larger, longer, cleaner, and more realistic surf wave. Eric, we've got this uh, display cabinet here. Tell us what this does and shows us. Yeah, this simulates uh, really how the Convex VX and the shape of Taiga hulls actually work. So let me turn this on here real quick. So basically, this one over on your side right here is a boat that has normal hook in it and how most you know wakeboard boats are designed. Why don't you push that against the water? Now let go. See how it pushes, the, the water stream pushes the boat up and away from the water. Well, with a Taiga convex hull and the convex VX, what it does is the actual shape of the hull 
grabs the water and sucks the boat further into the water, making a bigger wake. One of the largest displays at the Orlando Boat Show was Regal and Nautique of Orlando. Our crew got a closer look at the new Regal 35 Sport Cruiser. On my left is Tim Cook from Regal Boats, uh, actually one of the principals with Regal. So we've got the brass here, and we're going to talk to you about Regal in a second. On my right is Duffy Stanger, who's the uh, national sales manager uh, for Regal. And uh, Duffy, we picked the biggest boat. We picked the nicest boat in the show. Tell us about this 35. Well, you did. I'll tell you, this Regal 35 Sport Coupe is really an exciting boat. It's one of the only boats in the class that has a retractable hardtop that mm -hmm. opens right from the windshield. Mm -hmm. uh, so you have the best of both worlds. You can, you can either enjoy uh, the air conditioning inside here, or yep. you can open it up and have the fresh air. Let's talk about some of the, uh, the, the performance features of a boat like this, because it's a big, heavy boat to move around. It what is. kind of power, how fast, and, and what kind of range would you have? And this boat's available on either gas or diesel. Okay. We found in the Florida market that diesel has been very popular. Sure. This boat right here is diesel, for example. This sure. has the D3 Volvos in it. They're okay. 220 horsepower, right. so a total of 440 horsepower. Cruising speed on this boat, you're going to be in the uh, mid to upper 30s. Yes. Wide open throttle in the mid 40s. Right. I mean, this boat gets up and scoots. Now, a boat like this, uh, you can pretty much take it anywhere. It's it's what you'd call a weekender, or you could go in the Bahamas and spend a week or two weeks. Uh, Absolutely. Um, talk about some of the creature comforts down below. You have sleeping down below for five people, so the forward berth converts into a double berth. Okay. Of course, in the mid cabin, you have a nice sleeping compartment there, and then the settee folds out, yes. so that makes into a berth as well. We build 19 to 53 feet, and we're privately held, we think that's a strength, and we're uh, uh, ready to serve the marine industry uh, another 45 years. That's great. And you know what I like about Regal, too, is that there's a Regal for every family. Starting at 19 foot, all the way up to 53, you pretty much are going to find a boat that's going to fit your lifestyle. We think uh, dollar for dollar and hour for hour, uh, as far as family time, there's no better recreation than boating. And we've experienced that in our own a lifestyle and, and our own for our own recreation and we think more people need to experience it. Don't go away. When we come back, Boat Show TV is heading south to sunny Miami Beach for coverage of the Miami International Boat Show. not all be in the same boat, but out on the water, we're all on the same wavelength. In the Florida Keys and Key West. Hey boaters, if you enjoy performance boating and fun in the sun, Florida Power Boat Club has everything you need. We plan the best events and get you there safely to the hottest boating destinations in Florida. But you don't have to own a boat to enjoy the lifestyle. Social membership starts at just 69 bucks and includes the Power Boating in Paradise magazine, FPCT, exciting DVDs, and our great parties. Call our Pompano Beach headquarters, like us on Facebook, or visit flpowerboat.com. It's time to get in on the fun. Welcome back to Boat Show TV, where our crew is visiting the world-famous Miami International Boat Show, which takes place every February at the Miami Beach Convention Center. Florida Power Boat Club returned for their 22nd year as a show exhibitor. Jackie and Courtney had things under control, so Stu could wander around and visit dozens of exhibitors. Let's see where he's at. Making sure we get good coverage of water sports in the show. I'm with Tim McKercher here. He's with sea Public Relations. Let's talk about this new line. Yeah, this is the brand new 2014 sea Spark, and it's really poised to re-spark the marine industry. It's available in five delicious colors, bubble gum, orange crush, pineapple, vanilla, and licorice. And we have six different ways that people can customize and really make a sea their own with the sea Spark. We have a two-up version, a three-up version. You can also get it in our base model, Rotax 900 Ace Engine, and in an HO version. 
which will run 40 miles an hour on the base model and yes. about 50 miles an hour on the HO model. Then you can choose to get the intelligent brake and reverse system. Right. And then you've got your color options. Then we have a convenience package where you have an additional storage spot, a reboarding step, and then we've got a whole host of accessories where we have wrap kits, we have bumpers. What is it about the texture? What is it about the finish that's different? Because obviously it's a new product. It's made of a completely new material and architecture. We call it the exoskel architecture. So right. it looks very, very different. Right. And then the material is polytech. It's a polypropylene material right. with fiber in it. It's very lightweight. It's very durable. And it, it gives it a different look. It's a little sure. bit of a matte finish. Which is hot and now. it's very, very durable. And it's, uh, it's half the weight of any other watercraft on the market and about half the price. It's time to introduce Captain Don Mull, our local fishing expert who made a visit to Fountain Power Boats. We're here at the Fountain booth on the new 38 Fountain with Trip Mercury Verado 300s. I'm with my friend John Walker. What makes this the fishing machine that it is? Well, this 38 has actually won more professional tournaments than any other boat in the marketplace. Phenomenal running boat. Boat weighs 13,000 pounds, so when you're out in the rough seas, it really handles it well, but it still runs 70, 70 plus miles an hour. Boat's got 40 rod holders in it. 40 rod holders? 40 rod holders. Really? That's impressive. Well, they tell me you need that many to catch all the fish. It's powered by mercury. The, the fly-by-wire shifts and throttles, the steering makes it a phenomenal package to run. Okay. The, the boat is so comfortable. It's four seconds to plane. Right. It's, a, it's at 30 plus miles an hour in less than six seconds. So That's that, nice. So there's no hole shot problem. The boat really will get up and run for as big as it is. It has seven fish boxes in the floor. Okay. So we, we plan when you, when you run this boat, you catch lots of fish, so you need lots of fish boxes. There's two 40 gallon live wells in the transom. They're painted blue so that, you know, the, the fish stay calm. They're also oval, so there's no square edges for the bait fish to bump their noses in. You know, fountains coming back. I want to know a little bit about that. We are, and, it, and it's coming along well. Our customers are there. They've always loved the boat. I get asked the question a lot, is it still built like the fountain was built? This boat is built exactly as they've been built. It was a warm welcome at the Sea Ray display, where these lovely ladies greeted show visitors. We caught up with Ryan Steele from the Pompano Beach Marine Max store. Let's talk about sport boats, the runabouts. What have you got here, and what's hot? Perfect. Well, we have the... Uh, Sun Deck models right here. We have the 260, 280, and the 300 Sun Deck models. Also in the runabouts, we have the SLX model. Uh, we have the 230, the 270, and the all-new 350 SLX. Okay. I'm getting from the SLX a little bit more zip, a little bit more speed, quicker boats? A little bit more zip, uh, absolutely. So they're going to be a deeper V-hull. Yeah. Uh, the bow is going to be a little bit more pointy. You're, gonna, uh, you're going to be able to go through the waves a lot easier. Yeah. Uh, in our deck boats, they go through the waves just as fine but you're gonna, you're gonna have a lot more um, maneuverability and uh, uh, style with, yeah. our, with our SLX boats. Let's move on, let's talk more about the Sport Cruisers. Uh, you've got some, a good range of boats here as well. So our Sport Cruisers range anywhere from two, uh, 260 Sundancers right. all the way up to the uh, 370 Sundancer. Okay. Here at our boat show, we have the 260, the 280, the 330, and the 350 Sundancer. And then we got a sport yachts. I was on that 510. That's a sweet boat. Before you move on to the sport yachts, we have the brand new 370 Venture here as well, okay. which is the concealed outboard. But okay. yes, we do have the 510 over there, which is a, a very sweet boat. You, you get that, the concealed outboard, so it looks like a stern drive boat. It has all the beauty and sleek lines of a stern drive boat, but it's actually got outboards. You flip off the lid, and there they are. Easy to service, easy to repair. Not that they need any service, right? <laughs> no, no, not at all. Not with the Mercury outboards. But by putting the engines on the back of the boat, it's really given us a lot of space in the bilge. So even I fit down below. You can't visit the Miami Boat Show without experiencing the vibrant nightlife of South Beach. And Florida Power Boat Club's annual Miami Boat Show bash is always a hot ticket. Hosted at the Raleigh Hotel, the South Beach Party draws boat show visitors and the key players from the recreational marine industry for a spirited evening with great music and entertainment, including a sensational Valentine's Day bikini show. When we come back, it's time for the big toys as Boat Show TV visits the Yacht and Brokerage Show in Miami Beach. We'll be right back. 
BoatsDirectUSA.com is your Florida Keys connection for the best prices on beautiful new boats, used boats, and quality service for your existing boat. You will save thousands on new boat brands like Contender, Blackwater, Deep Impact, Statement, and Ocean Hawk, as we are the exclusive dealer. At BoatsDirectUSA.com, you will choose from the largest and nicest selection of quality pre-owned boats, too. Over 70 boats in stock. Financing is available. Just log on to BoatsDirectUSA.com now to get pre-approved. Trade-ins are welcome, so trade up into your dream boat at BoatsDirectUSA.com. Mile marker 98 in the middle, Key Largo. Need service on your existing boat? We have full-time certified Yamaha, Mercury, and Mercury Verado technicians on site, and we are your authorized parts dealer. Call today to learn more about our 100-hour services and general repair work at BoatsDirectUSA.com. We're back with Boat Show TV, where Stu got a closer look at the latest from Van Dutch Boats. We stopped by Van Dutch and I caught up with President uh, Chris Holtzheiser, who is basically the guy you got to talk to if you want to know more about Van Dutch. It's a brand we've seen more of in the U.S. and around Florida here, but we're going to see a lot more. Uh, I'm telling you, man, you, you've got some beautiful boats here, Chris. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we're uh, very proud of our brand here. We, uh, we started in 2008 in Europe and really uh, had a home run over in Europe. We, uh, we went after that concept that Bridget Bodeau started back in the uh, late 60s and we started ramping up and from 2008 until presently we've been delivering at least 25 boats a year in Europe and we've, uh, we've decided to partner up with uh, Marquis Yachts uh, up in uh, Pulaski, Wisconsin and we hope to build at least 120 boats this year. Awesome. Now we've got uh, a good variety of boats here. You've got a couple of new models. We're standing on the new 55. It's a wide beam stout day boat, wide open, a great boat, 15, 20 people. Uh, tell us what are the big features of this boat? Well, the boat has got a, uh, it's got amazing electronics on board. Uh, Simrad is the platform that we utilize on this boat. Sure. They've got a uh, sonic hub stereo system. We've got two subwoofers on board. Uh, these boats are basically set up for partying, enjoyment, having fun. We've got uh, three coolers on board. You can hold enough cold drinks to, to probably uh, sustain any party. <laughs> the boat has a uh, electric uh, bimini top that comes up. Yep. Uh, it's got uh, accommodations for at least four people inside. Yep. The boat easily uh, cruises 30, 33 knots, tops out at about 40 knots. Yep. Uh, it's a Frank Mulder hull design. Frank's probably one of the leading uh, naval architects in Europe. Sure. This boat will take you through anywhere four to six foot seas, three to five foot seas, continuously at 33 knots, very quietly. The only thing you got to listen to is the music. Now tell me, uh, you've also got uh, a bigger boat coming, a 75 on the way. We, uh, uh, what's, what are the plans there? Yeah, we've got a 75 launching in, uh, in May of this year. Uh, again, similar type platform, just a bigger version of what you see here. Yep. And uh, of the 55 owners that we presently have, we've got 11 people signed up on that boat already. and. These shows are proving to be uh, even uh, even more interesting as more and more people are signing up. Let's take a moment to introduce our second Boat Show TV guest host, Captain Richard Murray, who's made his way to the Ferretti display. His first stop, an incredible Pershing performance yacht. I'm here on board the 82-foot Pershing with Justin Blue. He's the brand manager for Pershing Yachts for the Americas. Justin, this is one beautiful, sleek machine, and I'd like you to do us a favor and tell us some of the finer points and some of the lifestyle amenities that we'd find on such a yacht. The Pershing brand is the is the, the, the top of the top of luxury sport yacht cruisers. We offer the, the most luxurious appointments, the most luxurious materials, but also in the highest performance package you can buy on the water today. Yeah, let's talk a little bit about the performance on this boat. Basically, this is a 82-foot boat with surface drive propulsions. You're right around 5,000 horsepower, and you're throttling up to 45 to 48 knots, depending on sea conditions, and uh, cruising at 38 knots all day long. Tell us a little bit about the interior and some of the appointments that we can find when we're not going at those speeds. We've got partnerships with Petrona Frau, so Petrona Frau furnishings, Petrona Frau leather. Petrona Frau is the same leather that you find in Ferrari. Um, everything that you find throughout the boat is going to be of the highest quality. And I noticed this boat actually does have a flying bridge as well, which is a relatively new development in the Pershing line. Yeah, basically what we've done is we've created a, uh, we call it a sun deck on top of the boat. And it's a, uh, it's a very low profile area with, uh, with sun lounges, with um, uh, seating that faces forward and aft. You have the option to have a helm station, so you have a second area to run the boat from. 
And uh, it's something that from the dock, it really disappears into the line of the boat. But once you get up there, it's a, it's a nice additional area to either run the boat or cocktails at the end of the day. One of the things I've noticed is this boat appears to be wide open. Tell us a little bit about how this wall just disappeared. So you've got two glass doors that open up and then the, uh, the whole system with the window drops down into the floor, really connecting the entire inside of the boat to the cockpit. And so on an 82 foot boat, you've got a living entertainment area of a 100 foot yacht. We hope you've enjoyed this first episode of our new series, Boat Show TV, presented by the Florida Power Boat Club. There's plenty more shows coming soon as we visit all the leading Florida boat shows and meet the dealers and manufacturers of the most popular brands. Let's all agree, there's nothing better than a Florida boating lifestyle. And Boat Show TV is here to keep you in tune with everything marine. Thanks for watching, and be sure to visit our website and send us your comments. Bye for now.